at Hebden Bridge. On the face of it, a beautifully carved American eagle, but pull a string and up pops a scantily clad US lady riding on the bird's back. Another risque creation from the Folly Bergere, again totally crafted in wood. Come in number five, your time's up, or two men in a boat. These and many other weird and wonderful examples of automata are the work of former art student, engineer, now a lecturer and artist, Frank Nelson. I'd always drawn and carved, and I, I ran a, a model making business doing industrial model making. So that involved movement, and I finally came up with you know, a combination of skills and experience that all comes together in making carved bits of wood live. <laughs> And all Frank's models tell a story. He cracks his whip and the tiger refuses. Again, the tiger refuses. Twice, it accepts and does its trick. <laughs> if you can tell a story with a twist in the tail, so much the better. And you have the, uh, the bottom pincher, bang. Oh yes, this is a mummy box. Coin remains in the slot while the sailor weighs up the situation, takes his chance, her eyes and mouth react, the coin drops as he gets his comeuppance. And the one behind there, the man in the loo? Yeah, this came about with finding the old handle in a junk shop, and they're now sort of nostalgic items. And they always had a tin bath on one side, a bike frame on the other, and a cat asleep on the roof. So he which was everybody's childhood nightmare. <laughs> what do you particularly like about it yourself? Well, uh, it's sort of a childhood fantasy come true. Uh, I actually remember seeing the film Pinocchio when it came out early in the war with my grandmother and seeing old Giappetto in his workshop and thinking, that's what I want to do. And now, 40 years later, I'm doing it. <laughs> Frank's latest creation is a scene from Dylan Thomas's Under Milk Wood, the bad dreams of a drunken sailor with his past coming back to haunt him. He's also passing on his skulls to others. One of his students came up with this idea, a bobber boy on a unicycle. Push him along, and he hits himself on the head with a brick. That's automator. <laughs>